these attacks in Paris, also the downing of the Russian jetliner, have really heightened concerns over security right here at home. Here's the latest unsettling claim from ISIS, a just released photo of a can of soda, which ISIS turned into a bomb to blow up that Russian airliner, killing 224 people. The governors of 31 states are now saying they will not accept refugees from Syria. And Donald Trump is going one step further, telling Fox News he would shut down certain mosques in the USA. If we, if we see that there's plotting and planning and talk of jihad and, and terroristic threats that we th think might, might be talked about in these places, if we can prove that, in that case, you would shut them down. Nobody wants to say this, and nobody wants to shut down religious institutions or anything, but, you know, you understand it. A lot of people understand it. We're going to have no choice. There's absolutely no choice. Some really bad things are happening, and they're happening fast. We go to the mosque to pray. It's absolutely horrifying to hear that our constitutional rights of free exercise of religion are now going to be challenged.